Hello everyone and welcome to my renovation.net channel. On Sunday morning, January 9, 2022, another fire with another tragedy. This time the fire was erupted at a duplex apartment on the third floor of a high-rise building in New York City. 17 fatalities, including several children and more than 60 people were injured in this fire, according to the New York Fire Department. Many of the victims were located on the upper floor and likely suffered from severe smoke inhalation. More than 200 firefighters responded to the scene within three minutes of the initial 911 call. The fire began due to a faulty electric heater in the bedroom. Smoke alarms were working at the time of the fire, but it remains under investigation how the smoke traveled so far so quickly in the building. The residents consisted of a largely Muslim and Gambian population. Investigation is focused on a door that should have closed automatically, but did not, which caused the smoke to travel so fast into the hallway. My focus on this video will be door closers in apartment building, which I think the main cause of this many fatalities. Door closers, please like, share, comment, and don't forget to subscribe and thank you so much. What is the purpose of door closers? A door closer is a hydraulic device that is used to automatically close a door after it has been opened. So when we install a closer on a door, if you open that door, it will close automatically. Door closers are commonly used on fire rated doors and fire-rated doors are located in fire-rated walls. So let's talk about fire-rated walls and fire-rated doors. In this floor ply layout, we have four units, one, two, three, four. We are separating each unit from the unit next to it by fire-rated wall. We're also separating each unit from the public area or the hallway by fire rated wall also. Any door located in the fire rated wall, this is considered a fire rated door. So what is fire rated wall and fire rated door? A one hour rating wall indicate that a wall constructed in a manner to contain flames on high temperature and support its load for at least one hour after the fire begins. That's why when we submit the drawing for planet check, we have to indicate which wall is fire rated. And also in our door schedule, we have to indicate which door is fire rated. Not only that, we have to also indicate if this uh, wall is one hour fire rated or two hour fire rated. Usually the rating for the door is a little bit less than the rating for the wall. So just an example, like if this wall is one hour fire rated wall, so usually the store it will be about 45 minutes. And 45 minutes uh, fire rated wall, usually it's about 20 minutes fire rated door. So what is the 45 minutes fire rated door? 45 minutes fire rated door gives 45 minutes of fire resistance. So the door will stand the fire for 45 minutes. The question here is, you live in an apartment or um, you want to know if this wall is fire rated or not. Really, you cannot find out if a wall is fire rated after it's been constructed, but there is a way to check out. Open the door and look on the frame and inside the edge of the door next to the hinge, a fire rated door has a metal tag listing a fire rating of the door as simple. So right here on the edge of the door, you're gonna find a metal tag and this metal tag will tell you if this door is 45 minutes or 20 minutes or what kind of rating this door has. For 2019 California Building Code Resource A Section 2.2, building codes require door install and fire rated wall to resist the movement of fire for a specific period of time. So what's the building code is saying? Building code is saying if you have this as a fire door, so this door has to resist the fire 
for a period of time, as we said, 45 minutes for one hour wall or uh, 20 minutes for 45 or whatever the code is saying. If the door to a fully involved room is not closed, a large plum of fire will typically escape through the doorway, preventing anyone from using the space outside the door while allowing the fire to spread. What they saying here, they saying if this door remain open or not fully closed, a big amount of a smoke and or the fire will escape from this room into the hallway and that will prevent people from escaping into the stairway. And that's exactly what happened uh, during this fire. One of the doors was left open, that's where the fire happened. So all the smoke uh, just went into the hallway and that's the reason for this tragedy. Even when it comes to glass in a fire rated door, this glass has to be protected and it has to be wire glass. Not only wire glass, uh, the, the uh, area of the glass has to also be calculated. There are three types of door closers. Self-closing fire door closer, according to the NFPA, with this type of door closer, when open and release door, they return to the closed position. What does it mean? It means like if you install this type of closer, if you open the door and uh, you go away, this door will close automatically. Second type is automatic closing door closer. According to NFPA, this door closer make automatic closing door. They are normally held in open position, but close when an automatic closing device is activated. So this type of door, this is usually not an apartment, but this is uh, the door will be open. And when the automatic uh, closing device activated, the door will close automatically. The third type is power operated fire door closer. And according to NFPA, this door closer are for door that normally are open. So this door normally open, but it will close electrically uh, if there is any issue or fire. Thank you so much for watching my video. I hope that I answered some of the question regarding the fire and regarding the door closer. Please don't forget to subscribe. I thank you so much and talk to you in my next video. subscribe to my channel once you click into any video you'll get the screen if you find that the word subscribe in red it means you are not subscribed once you click into it it will change the gray so red you are not subscribed gray you are subscribed thank you so much for watching my video